reported that he could take the uh, advantage of the pressure sensitivity in uh, the, the Waka into his tablet for free. Uh, so, uh, wait, I don't Waka tablet. So watch this video to learn how. Hello everyone, welcome to Christian Lab Lessons. Today I'm going to show you a way to actually use a program called Spoodraw. So the first thing is to go to www.spoodraw.com, then click on the downloads link. After that, you can download the latest stable version of Spoodraw, especially for your operating system, in this case, Windows. Uh, next, eventually, just press the, 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 the click on download link and then keep pressing next uh, until you, you, you press finish. I mean, coming eventually, uh, you open the file location. If you are on Windows, uh, you open the file location, go to properties and compatibility, and uh, disable DPI scale is a high DPI set. It will remove the blurriness of the program. So, the first thing is to adjust the resolution since it's too low for me. I adjusted it to a 1920 by 1080 resolution. Now it's looking a little bit more higher. <laughs> you can so eventually, so yeah, the, I basically you can start drawing now. Uh, eventually, this video is meant for actually um, taking how to use Smooth Draw itself. So yeah, so now we'll start drawing. So eventually, when you put more pressure onto the Wacom tablet, it would actually, since it has a pressure sensitivity layer, eventually it would take advantage of the pressure sensitivity layer. So eventually, it would actually uh, give a more hard. You could adjust the paint brushes. Eventually, in this case, I'm using like a traditional paint brush. Then I start writing Christian Dust lessons. Eventually, the advantage of the Wacom tablet is that you can actually uh, write words, and also it, it also can, can be used it to make his own videos in the exact same program I'm showing. So eventually, you have know, so, so you have a little bit of trust. Adjust the ink flow. Actually, if you are racing something, you can actually adjust that. Dad. You can even adjust the brush size if you, uh, and, if you want to actually save um, some of the nibs, which has according to my nib video and then you must have saw. <coughs> Uh, eventually, uh, yeah, you can add a new layer, especially by pressing the uh, clipboard. So in this case, I have a layer one, and you can edit that. Eventually, there are a lot of other settings to go through, but it's a little bit confusing at, at one point. You can eventually press the I to uh, hide the layer. You can only change settings for the layer. Uh, yeah, it's a little bit confusing, but very professionals will understand this. Well, Khan Academy actually uses this to uh, make his videos, so yeah. Uh, eventually, uh, you can uh, so you can adjust the layers. You can delete your layer if you don't want it anymore. Uh, so you, you can press the shift button to actually make straight lines on the waka uh, on the screen. Eventually, this could be good if you uh, want to make a pentagon or some shape, but you don't want to draw it. Um, the, so actually, this could be a good thing. So uh, also you can use it like for even the things that are other than paint. Also, you can eventually uh, you can use the blur tool. You can uh, adjust the colors. Uh, you can do whatever you want in this program. Uh, yeah. So actually, yeah, so you can uh, adjust everything. Actually, so you can actually uh, start drawing. Yeah. So also eventually you can uh, adjust, you can uh, you can fill. Um, any sense. So you you can actually uh, fill the whole background and have a kind of uh, visual, and you can color it. Uh, and also, there's a color picker tool, so they could uh, eventually, if you see a color, you can pick that color and use it to be exact. Uh, eventually, you can you press the control button to do the color pick, uh, to use the color picker pickers tool. You can actually uh, eventually uh, use the filter pen. Uh, also, you can uh, eventually go to the options, so you can zoom and you can even rotate. Uh, eventually, there also other options. You can clear your image. You can uh, you can load. You can actually, I don't have to that setting in the first place, but uh, eventually you, you can slow stencil for free. Uh, you can select everything, deselect. Uh, yeah, I'm sure I was like randomly going to settings and see what they're doing. Uh, I'm, sure I'm not the first time user, but I never used all these settings before. But I, you can even open file, so you can save the file. I would come into dot save in PNG. The main reason is that it would like get it become transferred, so I can say blah 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 dot JPEG. And you, I would come and use uh, saving the highest quality possible. Eventually, it 
connects the web and you have better internet connection. So, make sure this is Christian Now, listen, subscribe to my channel, like this video, and share it, and watch my last video, and share this video with, me with other friends on the internet. So, this is Christian Now's lesson. So, 2015 by Christian Das. So, thank you for watching this video. Bye.